Hello travelers, traveling Irishman here on location in South Lake Tahoe and we're at the Red Hut Cafe. If you're ever looking for a place to eat for breakfast that's been around since 1959, it's a local restaurant, go ahead and come out, out here and support your local business. Let's come check it out. Hello travelers, let's take this tour of uh, the Red Hut Cafe in South Lake Tahoe. So like I said, you'll find yourself needing a place to eat for breakfast. This is the spot for it to come from what uh, I've read a lot of reviews. I'll definitely give you a better uh, idea what uh, food will taste like. This place uh, originally had another location that, um, that was a donut place that uh, has been moved. And this is now the new location. The Gardner family bought it in 1984 and has since then has, ex has expanded. So we got three locations in the South Lake Tahoe area. But well, it's a very popular spot where they've got good rating as far as food, breakfast is concerned. Local, like I said, local business, whatnot. Little jewel box they got here. I think the atmosphere is really cool and really appealing. How it fits the uh, decor for the area of you know, you know, Tahoe being a, a ski town, of course. But it's got the old, you know, 50s kind of cafe uh, look. Or the uh, ski lift chair, obviously. So they got some merchandise here that you. You can buy to support the local business. You know, this shirt right here, that's pretty cool. It's a VW bus and let's get red hot. I said all got kinds of things here. <laughs> all right. So as I said before, this uh, Oh, they have like a soda bar. It's kind of an old stable. They have soda and make ice shakes and stuff. And uh, now it's just a normal restaurant. Let's go and uh, order our food. All right, guys. Well, here's the menu. The Red Hot Red Hut Cafe. As I said, they got uh, several locations. There it says I actually got four from what my uh, notes were saying here. Like I said, they're known for their breakfast. This is kind of their deal. Breakfast served all day, lunch all day. Waffles. As you viewers know, I like to support our local family-owned restaurants and businesses especially during you know this pandemic which is so difficult on so many people here the little guys get hard to hit the hardest so a little history for you guys as I was saying before it says in, eight, in eight, 1959 the old donut shop building at State Line was moved about two and a half miles down to its current location in South Lake Tahoe. And the original Red Hut waffle shop was opened. You can still see the original letters on the east side of the building. The owners, Mac and Lorraine, and their two daughters, Candy and Cheryl Lee, ran in their operation with Mac as chef, chief cook, and bottle washer. Mac has passed on. But Lorraine still lives in Gardenville, Nevada. Mac would hide the next day's bank and an old pair of cowboy boots above the freezer. Right All right, the travelers, the food is here. Traveling duo got some, they're famous, what they're known for, their waffle and bacon and eggs. They've been making that waffle for 50 years. Yeah. And then uh, Casey got the Eggs Benedict, looks like, which is another good staple they have here. 
And then me and Manny got the biscuits and gravy. You can never go wrong with that. Good staple of food. We'll go ahead and we'll try it out and see how it is. Well, travelers, let's dig in here and see how this biscuits and gravy is. I'm a big fan of biscuits. Tastes really good. Soft buttermilk biscuit, great sausage gravy. One of my staples I love, biscuits and gravy. That was the, um, pretty good, huh? Sausage gravy. I'm good. Very good. Well, the travelers, that completes our experience here at the Red Hut Cafe in Lake Tahoe. They said, if you find yourself needing a place to eat for breakfast, good food, hospitality, great service, come here, support the local business. A great time, safe travels. Hello, fellow travelers, traveling Irish from here on location at the Red Hut Cafe in South Lake Tahoe. And uh, so let's check this out. I'm just gonna do it over again. <laughs>